All right. Oh my god, I really gotta fix the way that transition works. I really do. That is something that needs to happen. Anyways, hello, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, man, machine, everything in between. Why is the there we go. I'm like, why is the game so fucking, like, there's no noise. That's because the game's just, like, super quiet. So weird. So weird. Right? So. A couple things before we get started tonight. Right? Number one. There are people over at my house. I have multiple dogs in my room. They may start barking at any time. They are both staring at me. Like, they feel like they're just waiting for their moment. So... I just gotta, you know, gotta look at those guys. Number two. Last time I streamed, you know, the last stream I did, did a little bit of an oopsie, right? Oopsie poopsies, right? You know, a little bit of a fucky walkie, you know, all that weird shit that, that, uh, Discord, fucking, uh, Discord support like to tell you. <laughs> we did, we did a bit of a fucky walkie. Um, apparently... I don't know what the fuck happened with my OBS, right? Some of it was my fault. I will say that immediately, you know. Um, but for some reason, my microphone was like very, very quiet compared to like the game audio, right? But even more so than what it, what it should have been, which is very <laughs> random and out of nowhere. So this time around, made my voice louder, of course. And secondly, uh. Put the audio down. So hopefully, it's not, you know, not too bad, right? Hopefully that's not too low. Actually, you know what? Let me check myself. Because I can do that. I can do that. That's why we have PCs, guys. That's why we have Soul Arrow. That is why we have Soul Arrow. Let me see. All right, that shouldn't be bad. I don't think so. All right, shut up, future me. Um, let me just check. Ah, oh, damn it. I also gotta remember. <laughs> I gotta remember to hit the record button. I gotta do that bullshit. All right, so let us get started. Uh, where we last left off, we defeated what the Tower Knight, I think. Yes, we defeated the Tower Knight. Uh, so we only did Boletaria, so we're moving on to Stone Thing Mine. Oh, also, I think I'm going to be going Dex build? I don't know. We have a lot of time to think about that because we're using the, uh, whatchamacallit. Touch the demon inside me. Touch the demon inside me. How much, how much souls do I have? Oh, I have zero souls because I, I fucking killed myself, right? But my souls oh no wait a minute I never retrieved my souls last time <laughs> after I killed myself in the Nexus oh no those things are gone gone right like they're not gonna be up here or like in in the corner or whatever the hell is that oh that's an item march my ass on up here uh if my souls were still around which they probably are not they would be they would be like over here somewhere right oh shit they are still here my 200 221 souls all right do 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 run my my cuteness down here. Um. Now there are some items we can grab while we're in the nexus, but I don't. I don't think none of them are like really crazy, right? I think one of them. No, I'm thinking of the cat's ring, but one of them definitely wouldn't be the cat's ring. That's in uh, Balataria, I think, right? Oh shit. Guess I'll fall on this one, right? Uh or I just won't. Oh. 
Never mind. <laughs> Fell directly on it, but died anyways. Yikes. Alright, whatever. It's just 200 souls, and honestly, I don't, I don't even fucking remember what those items are. I don't even think they're worth it. If they are, then fuck it, right? You know, who cares? It's only, it's only an item. It's only an item. Every fucking, <laughs> every Dark Souls player's uh, nightmare. Alright, so time to get our ass to Stonefang Mine. Yeah? Time to head down to Stonefang Mine. Alright. Not a part of me just wants to kick up the audio so bad. The last time it was like too loud. Alright. Against my better judgment. Kick it up a little bit. There we go. Okay. Oh, where is uh keep forgetting I got my own fucking my headset audio is like low. There we go. Alright. Onward to, to fun. First things first, we gotta get that thing started. Oh, there's a dude here. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> Hello there. Hello. Souls, souls. I trade fine goods for souls. Hmm. What do you have for me as I put my glasses on because I just realized I didn't have them on. Alright. That's better. I can see now. I can see clearly now. Lorraine is gone. Oh, pickaxe. Oh, yeah, yeah, they have. Okay. So, if you don't got the Crescent Falchion, right? Chances are you probably won't need the pickaxe. You probably won't need the pickaxe, but pickaxe, uh, pickaxe is a pierce weapon. Right? It's a weapon. <laughs> you need some Pierce weapons when you're running through here. Either that or like an enchanted weapon that we have. Beautiful Crescent Falchion. Our little town. Oh, it's a nice wee place. All those lizard eyed townsfolk are busy tinkering with stone and don't bother with old folk like me. Makes life rather easy for me. I can get away with anything. <laughs> I always knew there was a god. Thanks for looking out for me. My dog is fucking crying at me. Come here. Get over here. Right? Then why did you waste my time? <laughs> my dog was just staring at me. He's like crying. And then I'm like, get over here. And he's like, nah, man, I'm just going to hop on the bed. And I'm like, what? You can jump up there. <laughs> and why? Why you start crying for no reason? Not easy to catch, but they've got some fine stones, and I know where one of their nests is. Oh, I'm sorry, I can't give it away. <laughs> I know where the crystal lizards are. There's a little nest that they live, but I'm not gonna tell you. you. To <laughs> Don't you agree? All right, well, this guy's not really important. You can kill him if you want. <laughs> I mean, you can. I don't advise it, but you can. Now, this is where we came from. And over here... It's safe here. It is safe here. Time for rolling. Sounds perfect to me. Unknown hero soul. Alright. So, here's Stonefang Mine, right? You gotta run over here. The first thing you're gonna notice is a big old guy over there. Fucking rocks at you. Guess what? Don't get hit by those rocks. And the rock is active until the animation completely plays out. See, like that. Damn it. I'm just going to put this in here. I forgot that they throw two at a time. Alright, should be fine. Um, 
this is a shortcut that's not activated yet. Yep. All right. Stone Fang Mine. You don't got a Crescent Falchion, get yourself a Pierce Weapon. And if you don't got a Pierce Weapon, fighting these guys is not going to be fun. Beautiful Crescent Falchion, how I love you. Ah! Look how strong they are. That's what happens when you're hitting fucking rocks all day. Like it's Final Fantasy XIV. <laughs> what are you doing? I've been hitting rocks for fucking 12 hours. I'm tired of this shit. Oh man, the new expansion came out? No! Now I gotta hit more rocks. Oh wow. A complete whip. Oh! Forgot about you guys. I thought that was in like a different room. Alright, dogs. Yeah, so... Ow. So, our little fucking... I was gonna call them dwarves. Yeah, dogs got me. Dogs got me. One of the things that's really fucking great about Dark Souls is that, um... Is that, uh, whatchamacallit? Ever since Demon Souls, enemy that hasn't really changed the much, you know that much, from any other games, the fucking dogs. What do we do with the dogs? Uh, nothing, we just keep them, same as always. But yeah, I thought, damn it, I was completely unprepared for that to be honest. <laughs> I thought that was like in a different room. Okay, that magical backstab, that's awesome. If you're ever, uh, ow. If you're ever playing, you know, Dark Souls-like games and you see an NPC and the question is, is that, is that an enemy? Or is that, like, a friendly? Here's how you quickly check it out. You just click the lock on button. If you can lock on, if you can lock on to it, that tells you everything you need to know. It's like, oh, you're, you're a bad one. You're a bad guy. Like what the Billie Eilish said. Oh, what the fuck? Am I supposed to activate all the fuck the way over here? I don't think so. There's the other dog. Come on. Fight you guys, uh, fight you guys in this little tunnel here. Which is just as bad. That grass in my mouth. Start chewing it. Grazing like a fucking cow. Taking it easy. Now, I, for, I think I for, ah, fuck. <laughs> I can't even speak. I forgot what the enemy is called, the dude who threw the fireball at us. I think he's called the Fat Minister or something like that, right? You're gonna know. You're gonna know they're there because they're laughing. You know, that guy up there. Dickhead. But this is why we have Soul Arrow. <laughs> oh! That quick ass block that I did. Now don't be fooled. The minister might be a big boy, but he hits pretty hard. So it's always, you know, you can, it's good to get a backstab, but most of the time you probably might not be able to, oh, hello. Honestly, forgot what the actual good way. I think the I think the ministers might be weak to fire. Actually, I think they have resistance to magic. 
which makes them difficult for me. Oh, hello. I want to run back out here and see if I missed anything. Like you. Usually the guys with the big sacks slinging over their shoulders and shit. They usually got a, a good amount of like, you know, small little rocks to put in your pocket. Here. What the f you son of a bitch. Didn't know you had a combo, honestly. Did not know you had a combo. God, this crescent grass is so I wanna say it's useless, but pretty much is useless. This is like the little hidey hole he had. Scootle your little boodle over here. Pickaxe. Yeah, if you made it this far and you don't and you still don't got a pierce weapon, then I mean there you go. Thanks for hucking a fireball at me, guy. What does the Crescent Falchion, like, bubble up with? No, I should actually check that out real quick. It scales with faith, right? Am I crazy? I think it scales with faith. Alright. We're safe over here. What the hell do you scale with? Uh... How do I... Triangle. No, that's only for me. Gotta go into inventory, I guess, right? Do 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 do. You scale with. Is that faith or magic? That's magic, right? You scale with magic. Stretching. You scale with magic. Tell me, you can take this weapon all the way to end game if you want. It's that good, and they give it to you for free. Oh shit. Now this bridge is a trap. If I remember correctly. So I don't want to jump on that. But I still want to fight the minister. Mainly because I don't need him hucking fireballs at me. This is why we have solar. Arrow. It's like fucking, it's like that one scene in, uh, not Order of the Phoenix, what is it called? What, what's the movie after Order of the Phoenix? Not oh, definitely one of those. Ow. Uh, the Half-Blood Prince. That's the one I'm thinking of. When, like, they all fight. And then what's his face? Harry's uncle dies. <laughs> All right. Run. Oh, oh shit. I think I think I am just supposed to drop down actually. Could have sworn there's like a little area.
area or something that's like safe to walk on? Or am I wrong? I think right here. Nope. I was wrong. It was on the other side. Damn it. Alright, well, we're down here now. This is our life. Prepare for it. Prepare to live down here. Oh my god, it's so fucking hard to see these guys half the damn time. Give me a rock collection, nerd. It's mine. I'm not a warrior soul. Nothing. Oh shit. God, you guys blend in so fucking well. What is your magic resistance like? Dog shit. I mean, of course it's dog shit, because I'm out here using a magic weapon. Duh. That was a smart move. That was a smart deduction by me. Stone, sharpening stone. All right. Head on over here. Everybody can get some. There's enough of me to go around. I gotta say, Demon Souls, Dark Souls, whatever Souls. For the most part, for me, it's kind of like, for me, it, it's like a calming game, right? Like I want to sit down with a cup of coffee, maybe like a biscuit or something, like I'm a fucking dog. <laughs> a doggy treat, a Scooby snack, sit down, you know, have a nice little snack, play some Dark Souls, just chill out, right? Like, I can feel the difference. I can feel the difference between me and, like, some other, I don't know, streamer or something like that when it comes to these types of games. Because I sit down, I'll go like, ah, oh, yes, mm, time for story time, kitties. Right? But then, you know, you head to some other streamer or something, and then it'll just be like, it'll just be like fucking, oh my god, whoa, what, what's going on? Whoa! <laughs> right? <laughs> but for me, nah. Where did this lead? Oh, this leads uh, directly back down. And I just pulled that lever and I completely just don't even know what the fuck I, I unlocked. I think I unlocked the gate up there, I think. I'm not sure. I wasn't paying attention, to be honest. That's how relaxed I am. I'm so relaxed. Um, hmm. That man over there fighting for his life. I forgot, gotta turn here. Don't go straight. Demon Souls layout is not in my head. Dark Souls 1 layout will always be in my head. That will be that will always be in everyone's head, right? Like, oh you go here, then you do this. Then you go over here. Oh wait, no, not up here. There we go. I want that item. I don't even think it's good. I think it's like what? Firebomb or some bullshit? Oh no, a soul. Okay. Yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Is there a lover over here? No. Walk on over. There we go. And, uh, over here and drop down, yeah? Let's see, try stone. Sure, I guess.
have some of the magic. A little bit of kapow. There we go. Meltstone. Hey there, buddy. Ugh. <laughs> that death scream. Sound very painful. Slowly having your body atomized. Half moon grass. Um, I'm trying to remember where the hell. First, the lizards are. This is why we have soul arrow, guys. This is why we have soul arrow. Oh, damn it, I missed. There we go. Who needs locking on when you got perfect aim like me? Look at that, so perfect. I'm so awesome. I'm great. Let's all talk about how great I am. <laughs> Oh, what? Did that not hit you? You son of a bitch. You fucking adorable little fire lizard. Get your ass in the fire. Get your ass in the fire. And now you won't bother me. But since you're a little fire lizard, you'll survive. You'll be fine. Just chilling out in the... Lava? Magma? I don't know. Molten iron? This guy tried to kick a lizard? <laughs> you saw that? I don't know, I thought he did a kick. I was confused because I'm like, you can't kick in this game, can you? I thought that's only in Dark Souls. Don't fall in the lava. That's a bad thing to do. Now these guys, they want to fight. Watch your step. The hot, hot iron. jump in the ocean with them. That sounds like a fun idea. What the hell happened to this guy? He just run off? Idiot. <laughs> uh, guy just like, just casually walked off. I guess they try to like jump for the shortcut, but like didn't make it. Either that or it wasn't activated. Like this. Now to be honest, I fucking I hate this shortcut so much. I hate it because I don't like the idea of a shortcut being able to kill me. But you head down here. And we meet the other blacksmith. Uh, I haven't seen you around these parts. Ah, what does it matter? You need a blacksmith. Show me your steel. If not, head straight for the door. I would like for you to repair my shit, thank you. 
Now, I believe you come here to upgrade your stuff plat, uh, past plus three, maybe? I'm not sure. I don't remember. I think I barely ever talk to this guy. I'm busy. I'm not here to chit chat. Forging a weapon strengthens it and alters its character. Ores of transmogrified spirits. Their presence blesses the weapon. Ores of transmog. Okay. All done. I think you come here to like. Like, I know you come here to do something with your weapons. I'm not sure if it's to just straight up upgrade them or to like add magic or some bullshit. I know he has his purposes. But yeah, ride it on down. It takes you here, you ride it back up, and you're back to the first area over here. But then I'm going to keep riding it because I want that item. Again, I don't like the idea of a fucking chork up being able to murderize me. Fuck. I hesitated. I ain't gonna lie. I hesitated with that one. <laughs> I got scared, okay? Damn. <laughs> it's like when you're, uh... It's like when you're, um, whatchamacallit? Stepping on the train, right? You got that gap. And you're like, but what if I fall? What if I fall through this tiny gap? That or, like, uh, checking your shoelaces before you head on a- before you head on an escalator. Oh man, dude. Never never stand to the side of an escalator. Just don't. Just don't. Because if your clothes get caught, then your only option is just to take them off. And you're going to have a hard time doing that. And if you can't take them off in time, you're getting sucked in. <laughs> and it's not good. Oh my fucking god. They blend in so goddamn well. Head on through the fog. You need a better shield. Ooh. That fucking lightning reflexes. Come on, go ahead, swing your axe. Going for your combo? No. Do combo. Did I touch a blood stain? Man, this guy got combo breaker. Jesus. Put that shield up. Oh, you're gonna run over. My shoot up. fuck these guys are anyways. I'm gonna be honest. Like, they're not dwarves. Right? I don't think they're dwarves. And I don't think they're quite human either. Hmm, don't know what they are. Large Heartstone. Baby, you can have my large Heartstone anytime. <laughs> the most evilish laugh. Oh, <laughs> you're out here doing a combo. Oh, shit. All right, combo breakers. There we go. I need to buy more grass. 
Now what is over here? What is over here actually? Crescent moon grass. Now I think there's a crystal lizard somewhere over here. I might have activated it already to be honest without even noticing. Because I think come over here to this corner there would be a crystal lizard and it would just run straight in there right or am I thinking of a different area oh no I'm thinking of this area yeah this place has a crystal lizard and those two guys hucking rocks oh <laughs> whoa Really? Really? I forgot about that. <laughs> the fact that I even made it back, it's a miracle. Alright. Well, these guys are going to huck rocks. But I don't think they reach beyond this crusty wheelbarrow. Wheelbarrow? Wheelbarrow? How the fuck do you say that word? Alright, this is why we have Soul Arrow. God damn it. Don't gotta move. Bring him to me. Yes, sir. Bring him to me. I don't think I'll hit that enemy all the way down there, will I? Oh, I did. Nice. Come on, enemy. Slowly walk your ass over here. There we go. Now, I think... Oh, how the hell do I get past you guys? My soul arrow sh shouldn't go that far. What oh, might... Oh, it does. Oh, you stopped throwing rocks and you're just walking on over here now. This is why we have Soul Arrow. This is why we have Soul Arrow. Now, sadly, I didn't get the Crystal Lizard, because I didn't even get a chance to look at the damn thing, but, you know. Steel Shield, holy shit. Let me just check my surroundings before I start fucking around with my inventory. How good is this shield? Scratch my nose. 100% physical reduction, magical reduction, fire reduction, 70 this is a really, really good shield. Guard break 45, guard break 60. Ah, uh, but you need 18 strength to use it. Oh, I can't. But it's a good shield. Oh. Damn it. Might go strength build. <laughs> Might go strength build just for that shield. Valuable secret up ahead. I'm not sure if you're telling the truth or lying to me. We got the lizards. Wizards and lizards. Like a fucking Wrath of Cortex in here. One of the best fucking soundtracks ever. God, I love wizards and lizards. 
Oh, there was a dog there? Secret dog. Lived amongst the lizards. I hear another dog, I think. I don't see it. I gotta back up a little bit more. There we go. Adorable, cute little lizard. Put my shield up. Oh, that's why. Listen to the sound when they get hit. Ugh. Like a fun sound. I don't know how to describe it. I want to describe it as like a squish, but it's not really a squish. It's more like what you expect the sound of stabbing a slug would be. I knew there was another dog somewhere. Are you stuck? That dog gets stuck. Don't run away. Come on, get sliced up, dog. I'm coming to me. Alright. I think that's it for the dogs in this area, yeah? You somehow made it this far in. <laughs> and you still don't got a Pierce weapon or the Crescent Falchion, right? This is why they give you so many fucking sharpening stones. Because they're like, your durability's probably gone to shit because you're basically hitting these, like, scaly motherfuckers. Happen grass. some noises. Do with a pickaxe. You know what? You deserve that. You deserve that hit. Back is like not killing me, but damn, you know that feeling where you're like, Oh, I just need to crack a certain bone in my body. <laughs> and once you do that, it'll feel great and amazing. Like your body just needs it. That's what, oh shit, fucking rocks. Hey man, come check out my rock collection. Some pretty nice rocks. Unknown hero soul. Can you really call them a hero if they were unknown? Right? Can you really call them a nameless king if you never knew they were a king to begin with? <laughs> I am the nameless king. The king of being nameless. Alright. So now we cooled down the lava, right? So, uh... Not this way. No, no. Not that way. Over here. Wait, no. Which way? Why is this? Happy birthday. Oh, you son of a bitch. They expect you to get hit by the lizard. Over here. Here we go. Large sharp stone. 
poison resistance ring, which will come in handy way down the road. Half moon grass. Where are my enemies? Be wary of your heart. Thank you. Uh, be wary of your heart. Oh! <laughs> There's a room full of oil. And a minister who's just surrounded by it. Now I think there might be two in here. I was hoping that wouldn't really hit me, honestly. That's what I was kind of hoping for. Are there two of them in here? No, it's just the one. Okay. Well, come on. Let's have a magic duel. Why that? Huh. Alright. Nice hit. <laughs> that loud ass scream he did. We just do all this. What is this? No signs of the daemon. Not yet. Hey, official leggings. Nice. Not sure if that's better than what I got or not. Let me actually check. I can use some new armor. New leggings. Nope. But it does have good fire resistance. Pick, pick up the item. Stone of Ephemeral Eyes. Ah, oh, we're almost to the boss. I can smell it. That smell. That smelly smell. That smelly smell. That smells so... Smelly. There we go. Get rid of you. I don't remember if there's any other guys around this area. I think so, maybe. I thought there would be like other enemies around here. Okay, I guess not. Mbasa. Oh, the Chris Blade. Have I ever used this damn thing? Chris Blade is like more more like a knife, right? And I think it's I think this is enchanted too. Here we go. What is this damn thing? This thing skills with magic. <laughs> it requires 16 faith to use. God damn it. Hmm. Additional effects. No bleeding. Oh, wait. My Crescent Falchion has bleeding on it? Really? I didn't know. Never really used the Curse Blade, honestly. Don't think I ever will. Spider Stone! Hmm. Alright. Well, once you're ready, pull the lever. Hit the fucking lever. There we go. 
lever, the handle, the wheel, whatever you want to call it, I just smacked my fucking desk. Prepare for your next boss fight. Alrighty. I've been in soul form for so long. I love soul form though. Help! No. I will not help you. There is no help. Do or do not. There is no do or do not. I mean, what is it called? There is no try. Only do or do not or some bullshit. That's what Yoda says. Alright. Why do I have a sharp stone here? Light moon grass. Get rid of the crescent moon grass and the pine resin. What's that? I have all my all my grass ready for me. Alrighty. Time to fight the iron giant. I mean the iron spider. I mean what is it called? Is it actually called Iron Spider? I don't fucking know. Armor Spider. That's your name. Say hello to the Armored Spider. Ow. Armored Spider. Gonna shoot some fireballs at you. Right? And your goal is to get your ass up there. The other thing it will shoot at you. Which you need to be wary of. Sticky spider webs. It's been a long time since I fought this damn thing, so I don't remember. Up. Oh, last thing you want to do is get hit by those webs. Because then you get slowed down. Son of a bitch. And when you get slowed down, you can't fucking. Can't watch him call it. And when it does that, you want to get the fuck away. Oh shit! That's its big get away from me move. Don't touch me. You want to make your way to the spider as fast as possible. Stamina, come back. Get your stamina. And then get ready to run. I don't know why I did a physical attack while I was nowhere near it. This is pretty much the fight. Oh, fuck. Don't be afraid to heal in front of the spider now. You need to heal, you gotta heal, damn it. Oh shit. Like I gotta heal. Alright. Get away from you. And we're almost done. Now you wanna make sure when you're running towards a spider. Your head diagonal, right? Because most of the time, most of its, you know, projectiles are gonna head that way. Ooh, let me back off a little bit. Get some of this magic. Ow! Some of that magic in there. Yeah. Yay! Now pat yourself on the back. You destroyed your your third boss. The armored spider.
Armored Spider is not that difficult to the boss. What, what makes it really difficult is getting hit by its webs. If you get hit by the webs and you try to roll, you start like stuttering a bit. You know what I mean? But as long as you make your way over there, yell at its face, say, You don't scare me! And then when it screams at you, you run away. You'll be fine. You're going to fight the Armored Spider. You should have a piercing weapon, though. Or the Crescent Falchion, the thing that we love oh so much. Time to clean our spider soul. Our demon soul. Demon soul. So the armored spider demon. So what's a great power? I'm head my ass back to the Nexus. Alrighty. Back in the Nexus. You. Have you seen my corporeal flesh? Has my body gone rotten? No, oh, this guy's not going to be hanging around for much long. I'm sorry. Please leave me alone. You got anything new for me? Uh, what's your name? God, I want to call you Oscar so bad, because you, you're, you're basically Oscar. Uh, what's your fucking name? But perhaps our age will see the rise of new heroes. Storia, something. I would like to touch the demon inside you, please. Thou seekest the power of the soul, then touch the demon. Soul of All right. Life, My vitality is at 10. Yikes. Um, let's see. I put endurance to 20, so... I do want to use that shield oh so badly, but you need 16 strength. Uh... Hmm. I'm not gonna scale anything with my faith, because I'm pretty good right now. I mean, not faith, with magic. Oh yeah, magic's at 15. I don't need to scale shit right now. Uh... Intelligence. Not going that high with magic. Probably would be a good idea to get Vitality up a bit. Um, hmm. Trying to think what, what's going to be happening later. I really want to use that shield. I really want to shield. Let's get enough, right? Let's get enough to use the shield. Right? So, I gotta get it, what, up to 16? 18? I love how happy she sounds when she says that. She's like, I keep the candles lit. <laughs> I keep them lit. And I serve the flame. 18. Oh, God. 18. Yikes. All right. Well, fuck. My souls. Dude, nowhere near enough. Unknown souls, unknown warrior soul. Usually you don't use your souls until you have something that you want, right? It only gets me up one level. Shit. I need three more levels. How many souls did I fucking give you, Thomas? I'm keeping a close watch in your bunker. Gave you a, quite a number of souls. Down here a soul. Do. This is on. I don't want to use any of my Damon souls. You have a heart of gold. Not yet, anyways. I don't even think all this would give me enough to get what I want. Alright. I should get like two levels out of this, right? Yeah, two levels. 
Ah, oh, damn it. Four thousand is the next. Alright. Saving up for that, uh, whatchamacallit. For that fucking... Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch on this. Put these... These rocks away. Let's stop. I don't want to carry these rocks, man. Alright. Put away the Chris sword. With that. God, I want to use this so bad. Alright. You have a heart of gold. Don't you have a heart of gold? How many, uh. Out of curiosity. Oh, damn it. I gotta kill myself. Oh. Yeah, it's this set of stairs. Before I head anywhere, gotta get rid of my souls. Oh! Oh. Roll up the edge. Will that work? Damn it. Just far enough to stop me. I don't want to go all the way up the steps. You know, gotta do it. Damn it. I just want to end my life. There we go. Alright. Go grab my souls. here. I want to see how much killing those skeletons will net me. Damn, still, still not as good as using my hand. attention how much souls I got from that. I'm be honest. Really didn't. Because I need, what, 4,000? That gave me... Okay. Alright. 200? Not bad. Kill a couple of skeletons. some of this magic. Ugh. Yeah, you wasn't ready for that. Ah, just like I wasn't ready for that. because I'm just going to pick my damn souls up. Oh no! They got me. I just want that fucking shield so bad.
Come on. There we go. Almost there. Almost there. Should have been a backstab. Oh my god. Oh, I was hoping he rolled off the edge. Oh, what'd you drop for me? Blade stone shard. Thank you. How's that for rolling, bitch? And that's why we have Soul Arrow. And that's why we have Soul Arrow. Come on, aim. Aim. Can you aim? Thank you. Still not enough. I'm just gonna go kill myself real quick. Well, not kill myself, but you know what I mean. Take my ass back to the Nexus. How much do I need? I need four thousand and how much? Four thousand two hundred. Okay. I might just go strength built now, just because I don't want this fucking shield so bad. Ooh, nice overhead. Ooh, you really fucked me over on that one. Alright. Bring it on, Skeleton. There we go. Uh, just one more. Oh, shit. <laughs> just one more kill. And then I'll have enough for that shield that I want. Oh, so badly. Oh, Crescent Falchion, how I love you so. Alright. Now I got enough. Run back to the Maiden. Get my ass in the Nexus. And then after this, I'm gonna head over and head to 2 2. What are you doing, maiden? Thou seekest the pup, then touch the demon. Then touch the demon inside me. And centrally, of course. Alright. Now I have no use for this. Bullshit anymore. I can use this now. Beautiful. Beautiful shield. I love it. Hello again. Thomas, take my shield. Take my stone too. You have a heart of gold. Excellent. Trade your souls. Infin <laughs> insufficient souls. How bad is my shit damaged? Nah, not that bad. We're fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. 
All right. Walk my ass in here. The Tunnel City. Or Hydrocity. <laughs> Hydro City or Hydrocity? That's how you make someone mad in two seconds. Oh, I love this shield. But more importantly... Get your lizard ass over here. No! Aha! Fuck you. I love this shield so goddamn much. 100 physical reduction? Should have really been paying attention. Thank you for invincibility frames. Oh! So menacing. Can I force it to blow up? Shield. Do your job, damn it. Oh, look how beautiful that is. I love this shield. Honestly, this can just take me all the way to the end of the game. Press and falchion. Steel shield. Beautiful. Beautiful. God, I can't wait to do Dark Souls. <laughs> I'm just thinking like, oh, I can't wait. Like, I, I swear, after we're done playing Demon's Souls, I'm gonna straight to Dark Souls. That's the next game I'm, st I'm streaming. I'm gonna run around and do nothing but just punch things. That's what I want to do. Oh, you were dead. <laughs> I did not recognize the destruction that I created. But I think that's what I want to do for the Dark Souls streams whenever we get to it. Fucking just... Not like 100... Not like pure fucking... Like fist run, but... For most of the game, just run around with the Cestus. Just fucking... Punch the shit out of things. Punch the shit out of Artorias. I've done it before. I can do it again. There's something about thinking that like the chosen undead just wanted just wanted to be the Dark Lord so bad that he just started punching shit. Have you ever parried Gwen? And just punched him straight in the face. <laughs> Parry him on his giant on his fucking jump that he does. God, it's such a great feeling. You have your pyromancy in one hand, and the dark hand in the other. Alright, this is... This is a lie, right? You can't survive that. I don't think so. Either that or... No, this leads to... This is where the crystal lizard nest is at, right? How the fuck? I forgot how to get down there. Honestly. I don't wanna start I don't wanna start finding out right now to be honest. Do that after the next boss. Oh shit. I forgot what the next boss was. <laughs> and I just remembered. Just remembered. Next boss is where the true demon souls starts. The hell is over here? Nothing. Do your worst, minecart! Oh! <laughs> that little nudge it did to me. Ruined me. Let's use my half moon grass. Uh, who's in here? Fat Ministers? Fat Ministers. There's, a, there's not another one in here, right? Officials close. Nice. Want you to test your might? No, no, I don't. 
I am full aware of my mortality. Oh, forgot about you. Oh my god, you took half my health. Jesus fucking Christ. It's fun about the Crescent Falcon. If you aim high, right, and you hit them right in their little, like right in their little fucking star mouth, I think that's like an insta kill, right? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Fucking. Really? No. See, there you go. You aim high, smack them right in the mouth, insta kill. Going down. Going down for the count. Oh, that's a crystal lizard. Fuck, I'm not. Nope. Nope. Nope, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not following you to my death. You fucking laughed at me? Oh, come on, don't don't fall off. Oh, damn it! I got the souls for it. It's down there. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. And it's gone. <laughs> no. Uh, valuable corpse ahead. Yep, definitely. Oh. It was trying to bear it, like, burrow away, but I thought it was laughing at me. I thought it stopped, turned around, started pointing at me, said, ha ha. Can't get me. Alright. Where the fuck... Before I keep going on, onward, I forgot where this leads. I love you, Shield. I love you so much. Oh! You try to head down that fucking tunnel, but I won't let you. Oh no! Damn it! Oh, you're still alive. No! Oh. There we go. I don't like locking on to the lizards. Let it go. Oh, yes, yeah, the two black phantoms down there. And I think those guys... Are... Oh, no. Fuck, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> oh, no, you don't. You still, you still making your way down to... Goodbye. 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 You can you can stay there. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm not ready for that. No, not right now. What the fuck? Who died? What did I... What did I get souls for? Okay. Someone died. Yeah, like, what was that? A thousand souls? Did one of the black phantoms die? That'd be pretty fucking hilarious. What happened to this guy? Dude, don't tell me you got your ass beat by the worms. Aww. I don't think I've ever been killed by one of those things. Famous last words. Clear stone. Um, how do I get that? I think I just jumped down, right? I do, right? Yeah, you can just jump down from here. Yeah, that seems like a smart idea. Very smart indeed. I am a smart boy. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Should have rolled. No, I would have overshot it. 
How much was that? 3,000 souls? Ah. Damn it. Yeah, fuck it. I don't need to fight you guys. Fuck you guys. Can I run past this? No. I can't. Forgot the rules on the delay. Had so much fun. Forgot that the, uh... The roll button has a delay in Demon Souls. God damn it. Just lost all those souls. Reclaim your souls. A whole zero of them. Can I just run past this? Hello, Fat Minister. Goodbye. That was a nice trade. Alright. Um, let's see. I was being too cautious. Should have just rolled off, right? Yep, should have just rolled off. You're stone? Ooh. Unknown hero soul. Listen well. What do you mean by that? Oh, this has the stupid little flying motherfuckers that I hate. God damn it. That big boy down there. Put my shield up when I don't feel safe. The rule I live by. Don't feel safe, put that shield up. So this guy will not fight back. But that guy down there... We all know this lovable dickhead. He's rocking the adjudicator shield. Ooh, you're not mad like the rest, are you? Well, what jolly traveling companions are we, eh? Pleased to meet you. Call me Patches. Ooh, see that treasure over there? Go on and take it. My gift to you. Just to show that we're friends. Whew, I'm glad to meet you. These soul-starved imbeciles will drive you mad. Sorry, I was like I was like thinking for a moment. I was like, wait a minute. Don't you need patches in the... Hmm. Patches is in, like, every fucking Soulsborne FromSoft bullshit. I think he's even in, like, Front, min uh, front Mission. Right? But, uh... I think in one of the other worlds, you either meet patches here... Or, uh... No, you can still meet patches later on. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think. What's the matter? Though I'm going out on a limb here, give me a chance to prove my good faith. Patches, basically, he exists to fuck you over. <laughs> That's basically what it is. Patches, there are some bad NPCs. I mean, let's be honest. You gotta be really kind of stupid to be like, Oh yeah, thank you, man. Yeah, just gonna walk under this giant fucking killer monster. Oh my god, this thing takes a lot of hits. Oh shit, I totally... Oh no. Fuck you, Patches. <laughs> what is even down there? I think it's like a lone soul or like a pickaxe or some dumb shit. I kind of want it though. What the fuck? Oh, I have my catalyst out. Now, I believe 
that these things respond better to blunt weapons, right? Nope. <laughs> That's not happening. Damn it. Patches, I hate you. Because I believe this thing just like jumps down and blocks the way, right? I can I can just roll out the way, right? Let me see. Can you just roll out the way of that? I only got 500 souls. Fuck it! Treasure is mine! I like the treasure. If you survive, what do you mean if I just like walk off to the side? Like that, Patches. Just like that. You're adorable. I'm gonna call you Snuggles. I thought this thing like just kills you. Never mind. Well, you know what? It's not ruining my day. I'll let it live. I don't even know what the fuck I picked up. What was it? A pickaxe? Oh, it was the club. Oh, wait a minute. How much do you... I need nine for that. And only does ten. I do hate these fucking things though. These giant like lava bugs. Because they just take so much, so many fucking hits for no reason. Like they take a stupid amount of hits. They literally exist just to hinder you. Like, hinder you, like, purely. You know what I mean? Gonna run over here. See you later, Snuggles. And these are the flying ones. These aren't so bad. This is why I have Solera. Right. Don't want to waste too much time around here. Ah, oh, I hit the fucking post. Come on. Aim higher. There we go. Oh, there's another one. Race down. Alright. Not going that way. Gotta keep going for down. And I believe there is the NPC over here, yeah? Yep, this guy. <laughs> Remember me? I do. I've got plenty of wares, so bring me plenty of souls. I can actually use some healing items. Not crescent moon grass. Dagger. <laughs> Have you heard? Deep below this mine, there's a dragon shrine filled with dragon bones. Well, according to that scurper anyway. I'm not about to go and find out. Those bear bugs scare the living daylights out of me. Hmm. Oh. You hear that noise? These boys just waiting for their turn. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god, another one? Shit. Yeah, okay. Yeah, nope. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm not dealing with you guys. Come on. Alright. Now over here... I'm surprised I hit that, but also my catalyst was out and it shouldn't have been. Now I believe there's like... Maybe like three of them over here? Oh my god, you did a lot of damage. You. Piercing won't work against this foe. Oh, Jesus. Time for the fun tunnel. They loved it so much that they did it again in Dark Souls. I fucking hate this tunnel. Are you claustrophobic? Do you not like small dark spaces? Well, welcome to my hell. Um, which way? Way. When you don't feel safe, put your shield up. Alright, now you got these big old bug boys blocking your way. They hit hard too. So, don't get hit. They literally exist just to ruin your day. It's going to turn around and block me in. That's okay. And you know what? I should just go through it, right? Oh my god, you take way too much fucking damage. I know. But <laughs> That's just too much time. I don't got time for that. Not right now. No, no, no. This guy's blocking the way. Now, of course, there's goodies behind them and shit. Like, down here is where you can get the... Ah, fuck, what is it called? The Dragon Fang Sword? Dragon Bone Sword? Some bullshit? It's a, uh... It's a long sword. Claymore, I think. And it's fucking, uh... I think it's a strength-based weapon, and it has plus one. It also has fire damage on it. So if you don't like the Crescent Falchion, then that's the way to go if you're... Looking for a quick, a quick, easy upgrade, I guess. I'm lost. Go oh, fuck yourself. <laughs> ah, shit. What's about you? Oh, is this the sword? I think this is the sword. Hope. Oh. Yes, it is. What is it called? Dragon Long Sword. Yeah. Take a look at that. It is a... Yep, strength-based weapon. You need 10. You, you should probably already have that. And plus one, and it has fire damage. For some reason, it doesn't say it here, but it has fire damage on it. Also piercing. And this is where we really want to go. To the right. Fuck you. I'll look to the left. Nope, I'll look to the right. Oh, hi there. Big bugaboo. Actually, let me see. It shouldn't really do much, but let me just see. Having that big guy in the way is not going to be fun. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Happy they never did this shit again in any Dark Souls game. Just put like a big fucking enemy that takes forever to kill. Like in a critical path where you need to go. Yep, 
<laughs> this is this is Demon Souls. <laughs> Just gonna sit here and do this because I want this one out my way because this is a uh, path that I'm gonna be walking down. And this is why we have Soul Arrow. Almost there. Ow. Don't worry, my magic will come back. Too handy. Just be careful around this guy. Fight you. And then once you kill it, I want you to run the fuck the other way. Because, big boy, it's gonna do that. Did that kill the small bug? Of course it didn't. Of course it didn't. Come on, guys. Come on, little guys. I don't want to touch the lava. And I want you guys out my way, because that walkway is pretty thin. Now, I might be getting this mixed up with Dark Souls, but I think... Mm, this is where you get the fire resistance ring? Maybe that's Dark Souls. Both the games are kind of the same. Fucking god. Just die already. There we go. Alrighty. Now that they're out the way, I'm just gonna make a quick little... Man, this also sucks because you're, you're fine on this side, but it looks like you're not. Which is what I fucking hate about it. Don't get too fancy. Don't stay here too long. You can check shit out later. What do you have for me? Unknown hero so Okay. Oh my god, no, you fucking don't. Damn it, you're in the way. Welcome to Dark Souls, everybody. Welcome to Demon Souls. Hi, hello. There we go, just squeeze past you because I really. Uh. Yep, bad idea. Bad idea. Bad idea by me. Ah, I'm gonna have to run around it. I'm gonna have to run around it. Oh shit. Never mind. Woo! Got lucky there. Got lucky. That guy looks like ready to die. Is it health at half or? Oh no, that's a smaller one. Let's see, range attack is the best option. Um, yeah, I guess. I mean, I'm not sure if this is where I'm actually supposed to go, this way or the other way, but. Having one that's able to move around, fuck you over, not a good idea, just leave it be. So, deal with you right now. Get my ass away from you. Alright, what does this say? Recommended this map. Fuck you. <laughs> Alright. Over here. I don't want to spend too long in this area because I fucking hate it. I'm in trouble. Please recommend this message. No. No, I won't. Because I'm in trouble. I think I'm going the right way.
Umbasa? Umbasa. I do like Umbasa. Oh, Umbasa. Oh, Umbasa. Yay. Oh, yeah, this is the fucking... No, this isn't the Crystal Lizard place. Crystal Lizard place is path uh, past those... Uh, fuck, I can't speak. Past those two uh, dickheads. Touch blood stain. Why can't I touch it? Touch it. Look at that guy. He jumped down and he died like a bitch. Because down here are... Boom. How you died of that? <laughs> How you died of that? There's also two more, I think. Try to aim it correctly. There we go. All right. Now here's the going part. This is the way. And this is the this is the shortcut, right? Let me see. I don't have my telescope, so I can't like perfectly look. I think this is where the uh, crystal lizard ran. I think this okay because the shortcut's like always there we just took the long way around over there's the boss and over here is an extra item wary of hidden foes yep. this is why we have the soul arrow. There we go. I think there might be another one. Yep. Hands of God. <laughs> Put the fear of God in me. Alright. Grace downs. Run your ass over here. moon grass. I'm definitely not going to win this fight. Oh god, I have uh, I have 6,000 souls. If only I had a friend. I want to go over here. Stone of Ephemeral Eyes. This guy's going in there with the dragon. Wait, what? You're going in there. Maybe new game plus. Look forward to enemy. No, the fuck I want. How dare you? Uh, I wanna. Mm, don't wanna waste my souls, but I don't wanna run all the fuck the way back here. Ah, eh, fuck it. Don't wanna waste my souls. Do I have. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't have a, uh... I don't have anything to return me back to the Nexus with. Oh, shit. Let me see. There might be another another way up. No, there's not. No, there's not. The only way up is to head through all that other shit again. Damn it. All right. And I only have, like, a couple of healing items. Well, time for the hardest boss in this game. Welcome to the fucking true Demon Souls. Say hello to Cinder Demon. Oh, my bad. Not Cinder Demon. That's Dark Souls 2. Flame Lurker! 
Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Yep. The arena can set you on fire, too. Forgot about that. Ah, oh, fuck. All right. Gotta observe. I think I'm gonna pull my catalyst out. Ooh. Now he is... I think he's weak to magic, but... Not really sure. Not sure if it's normal damage or not. Keep my distance from you. Try not to get myself in a corner. Doesn't help that the fucking stage can set my ass on fire. That was a bad time to heal. Ah! Um, get myself trapped in the corner. Shield, I love you. Oh, you got stuck? Oh, you got stuck. stuck in the corner real quick. I'm standing in the fire. Let me heal myself. Fuck. Come on. I'm out of magic. Gotta wait for it to come back. safe with you. I love this shield. I love this fucking shield so goddamn much. Greedy. Let me heal up. God, I love the shield so fucking much. Now he's getting rowdy. Now he's getting rowdy. Oh, fuck, I love this shield. <laughs> Get out of fire. It's perfect time to heal. God. Stupid. That was a stupid timing from me. Fucking 
god, I love this shield. Trapped in the corner. That's my last healing item. And that was a dumb mistake. Fatal mistake. Fatal mistake. Come on, one more hit. One more hit from me. Got him. Woo. <sighs> I need a breather. Hold up. <laughs> Fucking Christ. Oh, shit. Thank you. Nice to see you again, Kabito. Shit. Fuck. God, I love this shield. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, man. Let me claim my prize. Searing demon soul. Fuck you, flame lurker. That's the true demon souls right there. Oh, shit. Oh, you enjoying yourself here? Just having, having fun? <laughs> Thou seekest the power of the soul, no? Then touch the demon inside me. You know what? I deserve it. Now, strength or fucking. Where is the uh? Where's the dragon bone smasher? Is it in the fucking arena with the boss, or is it before? I don't want to lose my souls because this is a lot of souls. But I don't know the uh. I don't even like using the dragon bone smasher, honestly. I do kind of want to swing it around a bit. Hmm. I'm going strength build. Soul of the mind, key to life's ether. Soul of the lost, withdrawn from. I mean, I might as well, right? How many? Let strength to grant. Ooh, so that's a lot. So the world might be you know what? I can even it out. I feel like you need like 21 strength. How much strength? Fuck, and I'm looking it up on my... Oh shit, I almost put my controller down on like it's triggers. Ooh, don't want to do that. <laughs> don't want to do that. I would have killed the fucking maiden. Alright, let me see. What's up? Dragon Bone Smasher. Uh, it requires 30 strength. Oh, shit. Yeah, no, fuck that. <laughs> the strength or dex build? Uh, da -da 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 -da. I think... I'm gonna go dex. Okay. Dex. Look at all those souls get used. All right. Before I go anywhere else, you got anything to say, smart guy? Ah, uh, who are you? I don't remember anything. That's because you're soul starved, my guy. You're you're gonna uh, disappear. Who are you? All right, you. I can forge weapons for you. Air my equipment, please. Great. You come back alive. You I'm take these again. rocks I'm off my hands. Take all my rocks. My rock collection. Great collection. 
Uh, not gonna be using these. Not gonna use the club. Not gonna be using longsword. This is why we have soul arrow. Hmm. <laughs> this is for flame resistance. This is pretty good to wear when fighting flame lurker. But I mean, that shield. <laughs> God, I love that shield. Oh man. Actually, let me see how does that how does that compare to what I already got. Hold up. You have a heart. This has better flame resistance overall, right? It's just better overall, honestly. How's my roll? Ugh, not good. What does this provide me with? Not much. Really? That bad? What am I rocking? Ring ring, which I love. And my magic ring. Guess I'm just gonna be using this then. Guess I'm not gonna change my clothes that much. Hmm. Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch. Nice. You can have this shit. And I would like Flexer. Dark Moon Grass. I don't need to carry these with me. Don't have Ephemeral Eyes. I don't need that. I can have my souls for now. There's my Flame Licker Soul in there. Mine Resin. Gonna carry that with me. What I need to carry with me actually is this one. No. What is it? Archstone? Be a shard, scatters with archstones found across the land, teleports back user back to the Nexus. Yes, I'd like to carry archstones with me. You have a heart of gold. I Don't do you? have a heart of gold. That is me. I do have that. Thanks for noticing. And I need healing. I well, I mean, I can always farm for healing items in Volataria. Hmm. I mean, if I do the next fight correctly, I won't really need to heal. What else can I use these fucking souls for? Do I need to upgrade my falchion? Oh, I can't upgrade my falchion. I think I can only upgrade it with the other guy. Um. No interest, eh? I can tell you're not going to last long. But I can upgrade the shit out of my shield. I can forge weapons for you. Oops, wrong button. I need to upgrade my shield. Plus one. You need hard stones. Require twenty. I have. I mean, required six. I have twenty. Yeah, fuck it. I love the shield. Plus two? I love the shield. <laughs> you come back alive. There we go. Alright. I am going to head back in here. Time to fight ourselves in what's called Archdemon. Or the fuck? Dragon? Okay. Oh, shit. Almost forgot. Almost forgot. That would have been a real, real bad mistake if I didn't do this. Run my ass all the way up here. I'm gonna have to increase my uh, endurance. To, like quit more shit. I don't want to ruin my world tendency. Wrong steps. I should be talking to the NPCs around here, but you know what? I don't really care that much about these guys. <laughs> there we go. Alright. Into Stone Fang.
Now this next boss is a puzzle boss. Everyone's favorites. Okay, read message. Barely made it. Me too, man. <laughs> oh yeah, there's also stuff in the arena too to pick up. I almost forgot. What do you got? A little nap and never hurt anyone. Dragonstone chunk. Two of them. That's great. And I think there's one more item somewhere around here. Yep, over here. I love how this item is in this little corner to get you stuck. And also, they put it right under a pair of jaws. <laughs> like, how subtle you gotta be for that shit. You're right. You went right into the mouth of the monster, huh? Hey, you. Stop digging on my bed. Cut it out. Dog is scratching up my bed. Alrighty. What the fuck happened to you? How the fuck did you die? What? <laughs> I guess maybe they got attacked by like a uh, by like another player. Beware dragons ahead. Oh, I will. I will. I believe to get the Dragon Bone Smasher, you gotta have white, like pure white tendency, right? And you get that after killing this guy. No, like. Isn't there, like, something you do? Oh, whatever, who cares? Alrighty. I don't quite remember how to deal with this boss, but we'll figure it out. The Dragon God! So the Dragon God... Ugh! I'm dead. <laughs> oh, I'm still alive! Aha! So the Dragon God here... It's a nice little, uh... I'm definitely gonna die. Might as well just get myself killed. It's a puzzle boss. You see how his eyes are yellow? That means he don't see ya. When it turns red, that means he see ya. Oh, there's the Dragon Bone Smasher. So your goal is to move around without being seen. This is the Dragon Bone Smasher. And they give you the Dragon Bone Smasher because... Oh, shit. Eh. What does this say? Time for slang. You don't use it to, like, break through these. I don't think so. Yeah, no, you don't. Do you? No, you don't. It requires 20 to use, yeah? Not 20, 30? Yeah, 30 strength. You gotta really want to use that bad boy if you want to use it. So. This whole fight is be quick. Don't get caught. You don't see me. Stop lying. Stop lying about yourself. The only problem is that I don't know when he's looking at me. Like, I get that he turns his head, right? But I mean, if we're going by the rules of peripheral vision. Right? Oh my fucking god. This is why they give me the Dragon Ball Smasher. Yep. Can't even use Block yourself. Oh, damn it. You got me. That's why you get the Dragon Bone Smasher. But. So pretty much the rule here is don't get caught. I'm not really going to be using my shield here. Oh my god, I'm not really going to be using anything here. There we go. Both like this boss and hate it. Go 
going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Ah, oh, he crushed me. Am I still alive? Nope. I just gotta remember, like, where the area is to stop is. Gotta remember where the safe areas are. But that's the problem. The problem is that I don't remember. This is probably the boss that I'll probably die the most to, to be honest. Okay, you see me. Turn your face. Turn your face the other way. I wish, like, using the thief ring would help you in this fight. But it doesn't. Okay, I think I should be safe here, but I'm not. I guess I gotta run back. And there's no reason to really use armor in this fight either, to be honest. Like, your shields are not gonna protect you. If you get caught, you're dead. <laughs> it's pretty much the rule of the fight. Alright. I'm gonna have to run back then. That's fine. That's fine with me. Come on. This pull back. Then once he turns, I'm gonna run. Turn your face. There you go, you cutie. And I'm gonna keep going. Keep going. Keep it going. Congratulations. Phase one of the fight is done. <laughs> Alright. Oh! The doctor told me it was only going to be a little sting. Fuck! <laughs> Look at that damage. Alright, cool. You want to hop your beautiful Tuckus down here. Now you still gotta be careful. He's looking this way right now. I think. Once he turns his head. So. I think I'm safe here. I don't think he sees me. Patience. Patience on the grass up there. I'm gonna go for it. Oh, he turned his face. Didn't see me. You know, for a monster that has like six eyes, eight of them, never mind, you got a really shitty peripheral vision. You don't see me. I want you to turn your face the other way now. Go ahead, turn your face. Over there. No, the fuck you don't! Ooh. Run for it. Don't stop. Don't. Oh, no. Oh! Ah! Keep going. Fuck you, Crystal Wizard. The 
free crystal lizard. Taking it. <laughs> All right. Phase two of the fight. Done. Time for phase three of the fight. Phase three of the fight. You want to put your shit back on. Just for extra protection. How the fuck do I get down there again? All right. Now, don't be fooled. This dude is still very much a threat. Did you see how his mouth gets all like hot and smoky? That means that motherfucker is going to blow fire at you if you get too close. But this is why we have Soul Arrow. Because fuck that noise. Because <laughs> fuck that noise. I'm not going near that motherfucker. This is why we have Soul Arrow. Hello, this damn thing. And pat yourself on the back. We did it. We did it. World 2, completely finished. And you have slain your first Archdemon. You did it. Pat yourself on the back. This is why we have Soul Arrow. <laughs> I love Soul Arrow. Legendary Warrior Soul. That's me. I'm legendary. All right. You've obtained the soul of an archdemon. The thickness of the sickness. Colorless fog shall oppress you for more. Now what that means is that you can head your beautiful self back to the Nexus. Yep, we are back. Alright. Thou seekest the power of the soul, no? I do. Then touch the demon inside me. I will. Soul of the mind, key to life's ether. Soul Next belt. Going Dex. Just gotta get a Dex weapon. Art thou finished? I am. May thy strength help the world be mended. Alright. So, if you're going strength build, chances are you probably want to use this damn thing. Right? And I used it before, right, during one of my playthroughs, and then I instantly well not instantly, I used it. To fight like uh, the pursuer, and then who else did I fight using this damn thing? Uh, the first two bosses I think of World Four. Yes, and as for World Three, who are the bosses in that one? I didn't use the Dragon Ball Smasher for that. I don't think I used it for World Three. Did I use it for the second boss in World Three? Yes. No. Yes. No? Maybe. I'm not sure. Think about the man eaters. Uh, but yeah, Dragon Ball Smasher. You're going for a strength build. You probably want this thing. It has a nice vertical swing, right? You know, it's big, slow, heavy, right? My favorite thing about this is that you have that. And you also got this. Oh, not that one. Is it just this one? No, it's one-handed. My bad. It's the one-handed run, right? No. One-handed heavy? Yeah, I guess it I guess it's only two-handed uh running attack. I love that swing. Oh god, I love that swing so much. Yeah, and then I think can you pull this back? Let me see. Guess not. But yeah, 
Once you swing with this big boy, you commit to it. You can technically use it, right? But you're not going to use it effectively to get the full uh, amazingness out of it. Also, the thing is super heavy, so you'll probably need... You'll probably use the Ring of Herculean Strength, and also... And also, um... Whatchamacallit. Super heavy, so you're probably gonna upgrade your endurance, like, really high. And then, uh, you know, do the Ring of Herculean Strength to help you out with that so you don't have, like, a shitty roll. Alright. You have a heart of gold. You have a heart of gold. I can forge weapons for you. I can forge weapons for you. Alrighty. Mm hmm. I have 6,000 and that is not enough for a level up. How much is enough for a level up, actually? Seven. Okay, hold up. Hold up. I wish you would tell me how many souls I get. Storied hero soul. No, that's too much. That's gonna give me like what? I got I got loser souls, right? Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch. Yeah, I got some loser souls. Throw that in there. Downed hero soul. Take that. You have a heart of gold. Do 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 do. Gonna use both of them. Two thousand. That was too much. Alrighty. My endurance is at twenty. So I'd like to have more. So I can like equip better shit later. Um. Where's my equipment burning? 50. Vitality. And item burden goes up. Item burden goes up, but not equipment burden. Yeah. Yeah. Do. Do, 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 do. Do. Damn it. X is at 20. Kind of want to get vitality up, to be honest. And I'm burning. I want to be able to equip more shit, too. I guess I'll go for endurance right now, right? Art thou finished? Thou is finished. Maybe I can. Maybe I can equip something. Hello again. Now. I'm keeping a close watch on you. Let's see. Wizard clothes, old ragged, officials clothes. Brings me to 25. Okay, so my roll shouldn't be. Nope, it is bad. What the fuck? Oh, 51%. Ugh. How heavy is this thing? Oh god, that brings me up by like 20%. Are you fucking serious? Oh, that's a nice. Ooh. It's a nice fast roll. And then my roll was slow again. It's also the fucking shield, too. Let's not forget that. I don't want to get rid of the cling ring or my fragment ring, because that's my. That's my free soul arrows, man. That's free! 
love my free soul arrows. Might have to say goodbye to the shield. <laughs> uh, wizard gloves. Hmm. This has helped me out. So much. So much so. Can't be one. Guess I'm not gonna be changing much, huh? That sucks. Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch on you. Uh, did it. All right. You have a heart of gold. Don't let them take it from you. Gotta check what time it is. All right. Oops. Why does it make so much noise when I put my phone on the fucking on the desk? Oh, Umbasa. My grandfather had unusual taste. That sounds sketch as fuck. He often visited Stonefang Mine, where he collected rocks of all shapes and sizes. Most of them had no value. But among them, he found a miracle stone shard, which he gave to me. Could this too be a sign from God? Sign for what? But among them, he found a miracle stone shard, which he gave to me. Could this too All right. be a sign from God? I don't know what it would be a sign of, but sure. Do you seek the power of God? Nope. I see. Nothing new from you. You are useless. Oh, okay. Yep. For a magic lesson. Nope. <laughs> Are you begging? No. Nope. That's not. Who the fuck starts a conversation like that? Come on, man. Oh. What was that noise? Is that my phone going off? Nope. That was the sound of the dog just yawning. All right. Making like little grumbles in its sleep. Okay, I want to head up here and see if that monumental is still alive. Because that thing should be dead by now. Run your ass all the way up here, come on. Hustle. Alright. Still alive? Oh my god, I thought you when the fuck are you gonna die? Have you received assistance from the Candle Maiden? She is a prisoner of the Nexus. It is her duty to lull the old one back to its slumber. That is why she helps those who hunt demons. And that is why she has become a demon herself. She's a demon? Oh man. You know what? I can get down with that. Maiden in Black is the best one. Best Souls waifu. Undisputed. But to be fair, I haven't played Elden Ring yet, so... At some point I will. At some point I will. Alright. Run your ass down here. Okay. Uh, where are we going? Volataria. Not really gonna do much there, but I just wanna bask in the glory. <laughs> That's one way to put it. Alright. God, fast. Fast loading. I love you. Here in Volataria, now that you killed an archdemon, this thick colorless fog is open to you. I also recommend that you don't do it yet. <laughs> I don't think you're ready for this place yet.
Alrighty. And here you'll be greeted by some lovely dogs. Where are they? Let's see, how much damage do you guys take? Ooh, three hits. Three hits for the dogs. Try to get fancy with it. Now, I wholeheartedly recommend that you don't do this area yet, honestly. Which is why I'm just gonna grab this shit and I'm gonna turn my ass around and get the hell out of here. How far did I get in my first try of deaths? Uh, I beat... I beat Boletaria, right? I beat Stunfeng Mines. I didn't beat the old monk in Latria. And I think I beat the Storm King, and I just didn't touch fucking the Valley of Shit, whatever it's called, <laughs> you know? I just didn't touch that, and that's where I kind of stopped. Because I was like, ooh, Dark Souls Remastered, and then I played that. And then I went, maybe I should play Scholar of the First Sin, and then I stopped. <laughs> I was like, nope, Dark Souls 2, I'll come back to you one day, right? Swamp area is fucking stupid. I know. Miyazaki keeps uh, fucking making more. Right? So far with uh, Dark Souls games, I've, uh, I haven't beat Deaths. My first playthrough, the stupidest thing I probably ever did, but also the most funnest thing I ever did. My first playthrough of Dark Souls, uh, I, I beat the game using the Cestus. <laughs> so I just basically punched everything. And I loved it. The only time I didn't punch everything was, um, whatchamacallit, fucking Ornstein and Smaug. I had to use, I think I used the dragon bone bullshit. I punched out Artorius, but everything else in that Artorius DLC, I didn't, I used the Artorius set to fight, right? And then after that, I punched everything else out. So... Artorius, I punched his face. Oh, Artorius and, uh, wherever the fuck the weird Chimera bullshit is that you fight before Artorius. When you walk into the DLC area. Uh, even, even fucking, uh, what's his name? See, the scaleless. I fucking punched his lights out. I think, uh, I think I have, I think I have, like, a recording on my Switch or something. Where I punched Artorius' face in. <laughs> it was a fun fight. He is fast. He is a fast boy. Right? I want to say probably the worst boss... Like, the worst boss I did with that run, my first run, just punching everything, was the, uh, what's it called? The, uh, the Four Kings? <laughs> my god, the Four Kings. They're scary. I hate those guys. But I love them because they're so cool. Alright, where the fuck am I going? I'm not going to Shit Vale. Uh... Either Latria, do I want to fuck with Cthulhu monsters, or fucking do I want to, do I want to mess around with the old heroes? The old heroes are pretty fucking cool. I like the old heroes. But there's a lot of skeletons. Also, fucking, this shit out of here. <laughs> oh no. I even go fight the skeletons? I don't have that many healing items. I need to like head back to fucking whatchamacallit the Baltari and just kill some zombie boys. I'm gonna step one foot in Latria. And then I'm gonna nope out of there. <laughs> Let me see. I'm not gonna lie. Demon Soul scares the shit out of me. Mainly because it's so fucking dark. Yeah, but the uh, Dark Souls games I've I've um I played is like I didn't beat Demon Souls. I beat Dark Souls. 
I didn't beat Dark Souls 2 because fucking god Dark Souls 2. God, those hitboxes are so fucking annoying. But I'll do it one day before we get to Dark Souls 3, whenever the hell. Really? 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 You're not even supposed to be active over there! No! We can't even hit each other! Unnecessary. Oh, it's locked. I need the key. I forgot I need the key. Stop it! Mind flare, son of a bitch. No one likes the mind flares. This is why- oh, look at him run. <laughs> look at him. Oh yeah, they're resistant to magic. Oh, he's gonna take my soul. I can survive this, no problem. With that, maybe not. Ugh. And I'm dead. The graphics in the remakes are amazing. Oh, they're fucking great. Congratulate the music in the original deaths. Slower and creepier. Ambiance. Yeah, when it comes to deaths, I prefer ambiance. When it comes, when it comes to Dark Souls, I want that music. <laughs> I want to head to Anne Orlando and just, and just go like, thank you, Tarkus. Thank you for everything you've given me. <laughs> and then find his corpse in a corner. The new music adds a lot of hype. It does. I love the, uh, I love the Fool's Idol. Fool's Idol is great. Yeah, but, um. I keep, you know, after Dark Souls 2, I played the beginning of Dark Souls 3 and I didn't get that far because I just kind of dropped it. Then I was like, ooh, Bloodborne. <laughs> Let's play some of this. And I got like probably midway, maybe. Fucking God, I hate these motherfuckers. This is where the thief ring comes in handy. You know what? Yeah, no. I should actually be running around here with the thief ring because magic's not really going to help out that much. And I have Sekiro, but I haven't touched it. And I played Neo 1, haven't played Neo 2. I have Neo 2, but I didn't beat Neo 1 either. And I have not touched, uh, whatchamacallit. I don't even have fucking, um, Elden Ring. I wanted to get it, but then I was like, nah. I was like, nah, gotta beat all the other games. Something inside me is just like, you're not ready. You're not ready, young girl. Only got halfway through DS3. I didn't even get halfway. I got like to the first area, beat the quote unquote tutorial boss, and then. What's the boss after that? Uh, what's his name? Boris or something? He's like the big ice guy that walks on all fours. But I'm not gonna lie, I did I did see some other stuff in, in Dark Souls 3. I didn't get to it, but I, I did look at some of the fights. And oh my god, the dancer? The dancer? Okay. <laughs> okay. I see you. Uh fuck. What was I doing again? Yeah, I'm not gonna use my catalyst and I'm not gonna use this, but I am gonna use the thief ring. It becomes harder to detect. Because having mind flares just fucking try and kill me every two seconds is not fun. The fact that he has a hard time of finding me now is great. I love you, Thief Ring. Now turn the fuck around. I said, turn around. I love you, Thief Ring. You're the... The ring, I love you. Look how invisible I am. Oh my god! I gotta two-hand it with you. Ah, fucking jackass. Yeah, no, I gotta... Ooh. 
We're heading back to the Nexus. There's no fucking way I'm running around here with the Crescent Falchion. It's just not going to work. <laughs> it's just not going to work. The hell? Here it is. Wait, no, that's not the place. Where the fuck is... Here it is. Jesus. Really like the story in Neo 1, but it took 90% of the game to get there. Most of the story is very, and kind of like how most of Final Fantasy is trying. I've played the beta for that. There's a video on my YouTube channel, right? But, uh, man, I forgot Strangers of Paradise was even a thing. Chaos. Must kill chaos. But, yeah, I, I do want to play Strang uh, Strangers of Paradise. Gangsters in Paradise. <laughs> Final Fantasy. Gangsters in Paradise. <laughs> Gangsters Paradise. <laughs> I do want to play it, though. Actually, is that game on sale right now? I think it might be. You have a heart of gold. Alright. This requires how much strength to use? Ten. So it shouldn't be that much of a problem. Ooh, a nice good thrust. That's what she said. Hmm, <laughs> wonderful thrusting power for her pleasure. Alright. Let's see how this fares against the Cthulhu monsters. Spawn the cast off pays off in the end. Haven't seen it on sale though, but the DLC is currently there's fucking DLC for it? <laughs> currently being released, which was pretty good so far. Did it sell well? Did that game sell well? I hope it did. Right? I mean let's be honest, it's just the one thing about uh Stranger's Paradise is that why the fuck are the characters so bland? Oh, that's better. Oh, but my shield sucks. Yeah, but why the fuck are the characters so bland in that? It's like, this is Garland. Did you know that in Final Fantasy 1, while you're fucking anime protagonist with his beautiful armor and... and I don't even know if his hair is supposed to be white or not. I think that's just the, the armor around him. But... Beautiful armor and the nice white hair sticking out and fucking the beautiful like old ass Final Fantasy artwork and it's like did you know the guy under that fucking armor that big awesome armor that looks great in Dissidia is just a basic bitch white guy <laughs> like, and he's just sitting there going oh, you gotta kill chaos you gotta kill me I am chaos and yeah, there we go yeah this sword is way better boom yeah, part three DLC, one out of three. Oh my fucking what? Three of them? Did that game sell good enough to have three DLCs? Fortunately, don't think it's a million seller. Most people think the story is bad, and will be because you know Kingdom Hearts. Trust me, is it made by? Is did Tetsuya Nomura even have a hand in it? You know what's really funny about like Final Fantasy remake, uh, Final Fantasy Seven remake? It's like. At the end, a lot of people will like, you know, minor spoilers here. At the end, people are like, oh, what's this Kingdom Hearts bullshit, right? And it's like, the fun part about that is that, even though Tetsuya Nomura worked on the game, it wasn't his idea to do, he didn't want that to happen in the end. He was, he wanted it to be more like the original game. But the other dude who was working with him, forgot what his name is, I think it's like Ueda or some bullshit. Fucking, he was like, nah, man. Nah, man. Do it like this. Make it like Kingdom Hearts. I love that shit. <laughs> so for once, Tetsuya Nomura didn't fuck it up. And then after that, Tetsuya Nomura was like, "Hey guys, what if we made a? What if I try to make Versus Thirteen again? <laughs> what if we just? What if we just took an anime guy with the Sasuke haircut and just fucking put him in a car and he has his?" hand on his elbow or wherever the fucking dumb shit is and he's like sleeping then he wakes up and he's like oh that's a weird dream <laughs> like you know the ff story pretty well knowing dissidia um dissidia dissidia fucking 
Dysodia, however you want to do it. But if you know Final Fantasy 1 story, I think you'll like Strange Paradise. What story? <laughs> the story is, you talk my princess, go get her. <laughs> and then you save the princess, and then Garland was like, haha. He was like, have you ever heard of, have you ever heard of Killer Queen? And then you went, what? And then you killed him, and then he fucking went back in time. <laughs> And then it was a loop that made no sense. That's the only thing I know, right? Get stunned, bitch! I don't even know why I'm fucking around the Tower of Latria. I know I'm not gonna I'm not gonna have time to even like finish this place, and I don't even have enough healing items to deal with this bullshit right now, honestly. Why is this guy just sticking out? Stop. I do remember Tower of Latria does have a uh got a nice little like a nice little um whatchamacallit. Like a hole in the middle somewhere. Come here, bitch. Let's fuck him up completely. Our spice and everything nice. This beautiful door here. Where's the keys? Not here. Oh, here it is. Well, no, that one doesn't have keys on it. Exactly, the Final Fantasy 1 story is super sparse, but the fact that it could add so much to the NES time loop is pretty cool. I do like going back and checking out things. Just have to see how they do it. Whenever you get the chance to check it out. Is Stranger, uh, Strangers... Stranger than Paradise, Jesus. Uh, fucking... God. <laughs> I stutter every time I say the name. Because I I'm just like one second away from saying Gangster's Paradise, but um, fucking uh, Strangers in Paradise. Is that on the Switch? Did it get a Switch release? Because I might just I might just buy it on the Switch. It might not be good, but I might just buy it just to have something to do on the go. If not, then you know, I might just get it on PC. <laughs> mod in the warrior of light and just go ah yes final fantasy one my favorite don't think so things on ps4 or 5 pc only didn't get an xbox release what wow. what it would have hmm strange paradise playstation exclusive <laughs> console exclusive didn't think that would be i think they would choose that for something else oh wait they're doing that for final fantasy 16 oh my god when 16 comes out here's the thing i fucking oh god I love being able to stream, right? But I hate that. I hate that if I ever try to stream any like new releases or anything, I know for a fact no one will watch because they're gonna go watch some fucking other dickhead who never touched the Final Fantasy game go, hey guys, new Final Fantasy game. I love Final Fantasy, you know what I mean? That weird thing. Where everyone's like, I love this game. I never touched any of the other ones though. <laughs> right? So, you know. Like, I would love to stream Final Fantasy 16 when it comes out, but there's no reason to. There's, like, absolute zero reason for me to do that. Not worth it. But, Jesus, I know when 60 comes out, I'm, I'm gonna pull out of work for, like, a week or some bullshit. I don't know. Made them exclusive for some reason. 16's like that, too. I'm just waiting for, like, the moment when playing 16... Like, I look at the corner of my eye, and then someone goes like, Did you know that this game connects to Final Fantasy XIV? And I'm like, yes. Yes, I do. <laughs> it all connects to it. Thank you, Yoshi P. I love you. My favorite thing about Yoshi P is when... Is when he's doing, like, the live letters, and then shit doesn't go his way. And then they actively have to tell people, Guys, Yoshi P isn't angry. He just has a really bad case of resting bitch face. <laughs> He's not mad. I was like, I don't know, man. He looks pretty mad. Let me talk about Final Fantasy for fucking hours. Final Fantasy VIII, great soundtrack. 
I know a lot of people don't like the game, but it's pretty cool. That's what you think happened to Strangers in Paradise. All the Dark Souls streamers played it and kept begging. Yeah. It's like when SMT5 came out. Like, the first review you see from, like, it's always fucking IGN, right? It's like, the first review you see is like, this game tries to be Persona, but it's not Persona. And it's like, it hasn't been Persona for years. Persona's the spinoff series, you fucking moron. <laughs> right? <laughs> you want to play Persona, go play Persona. I love both of them, but listen. I love Shin Megami Tensei. It's all right. Shin Megami Tensei 3 Nocturne. Everybody can go fuck themselves. I don't care. That game is not a good game. It's a fun story. It's not a good game. That's a bad game. It's a bad game. I don't like it. Where the fuck am I going? <laughs> I'm supposed to go this way, right? Yeah, this way, and then there's like... There's like a cell that I walked through, right? I'm not here fucking around in Latria like an idiot. Should be like a cell with a hole in it or some shit, right? lost. I always get lost in Tower of Latria. I always do. There's no way that I don't. Let me see. Maybe it's just up here, right? Maybe there's like another passageway over here. Yeah? No? Is there like a Oh, there it is. My ass over here. Uh, let's see. SMT isn't my style, since it's really heavy on the battle system. Yeah, SMT is like nothing but... Literally, I love watching people who love Persona go, should I try SMT? And then I go, yeah, go ahead, buddy. Try it. Here. <laughs> right? Because then, cause then they play it, and the game starts, and you're like, you know, hanging out with your buddies in the high school or whatever the fuck dumb shit you're doing. And then it just, and then after that, it goes like, now you fight for like 10 hours. See you later. <laughs> Forget about, forget about hanging out with your buddies. It's like, it's like, well, does SMT have romance? No, it doesn't have romance. Shut up. <laughs> SMT just exists to, like, break your soul most of the time. Great. Like, I swear to God, like, fucking, like, look at, look at people's, uh, people trying SMT5 for the first time and there's like the character you know she gets her name splashed on the screen what's her fucking name uh the one that like Tao's best friends with or whatever you know the one that uh I don't want to say anything spoilers I forgot her fucking name it's like a really big name it's like a it's like a big name and it's kind of it's kind of like weird <laughs> you know but like it's like oh you gotta save her or whatever right so then you go to save her, and they're like, and people are like, wait a minute, can I save this character? And I'm like, I don't know, can you? <laughs> Guys, get out of here. I told you Melty Blood is in the bathroom. I want to play it. wonder what Soul Hackers 2 game is going to be closer to. It'll definitely have an in-depth battle system. I haven't played the other Soul Hackers. The only SMT games that I've really touched is SMT1. That's right, the SNES one. <laughs> SNES or NES? I think SNES. No, NES. NES. Yeah, I think it was an NES title. Um, you know, that one where like your mom gets killed by a demon, and then one of the one of your teammates go, "Come on, man, we gotta go get the bad guys." And then the other dude goes, "Calm the fuck down. His mom just died, idiot." <laughs> Hello, sir. I would like to talk to you about your car's extended warranty. 
It's over fucking you. Oh, you can't touch me through the bars. That's great. <laughs> yeah, I played SMT 1. I I didn't finish SMT 4. Like, I was in the middle of it, and I forgot. I stopped playing SMT 4 because I went, Ooh, Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. I'll play this game again. <laughs> right? And then I was like, When does Xenoblade 3 come out? Oh, I gotta beat 2. And then I went and beat 2 and collected all the blades and did that bullshit. Over 100 hours of just nonsense. Right? But I loved it. I'm playing Xenoblade 3 right now, by the way. But yeah, played a little bit of SMT4, the one that's like vastly different from all the other SMTs. Probably the ones that Persona fans would like the most. I'm dead. That dude shanking me. He said, welcome to prison. Get stabbed. Right? Um, I played that, you know... I'm switching between, right now I'm switching between SMT5 and fucking uh, Xenoblade 3. I want to say I might be halfway through SMT5 because I'm like level 40 or something, right? You know, SMT's SMT. And um, I played Nocturne, I beat Nocturne, and I fucking hated it. Like I love I love the story and I love like the themes and I love all the other shit. But man, even when I'm in like a safe area quote unquote safe area, like two steps and I'm getting into fucking random battles and all the bosses are just kind of annoying for no reason. Like playing the game blind is like how the fuck am I how the fuck am I supposed to know that I gotta fight the boss during the full moon of the Kagetsuchi? To see its fucking shadow that I can barely see because the game is so fucking dark. Right? Like. Fucking dumb. Stupid shit. You know? And like all. And then when you get to the fucking end of the game and you're having like this gauntlet of bosses and each of them have their own gimmicks and dumb, stupid shit. It's like, god damn it. And it's like, oh, well, you can use uh, your abilities and, like, some items to avoid random encounters, but that only lasts for a total of 10 seconds because the Kagetsuchi cycle fucking just doesn't stop. <laughs> so annoying. I fucking hate it. Right? Nice dodge rolls would have been tougher if I was holding the sword. Yeah. I'm used to doing stupid shit. And like Dark Souls. Well, at least Dark Souls 1, because I'm just like, fuck this, fuck this enemy, I don't care, just going over it. The one thing I gotta get used to, though, is the delay. Or, um... The delay- Oh! I love to watch them shuffle. Why did he go in the corner? B-Fring, I love you, I just turned the corner and he's like, where'd you go? Can you backstab these guys? No. You stop. You don't see me. You don't see me. You don't see me. The Frank is so fucking broken in this game. You can backstab these fuckers, right? Ugh. I can just hear the fool idols just singing the whole entire time. She got all them hands? They do. I don't know. Maybe act your girl Nico. Oh, shit! <laughs> Should have looked down. I forgot. I forgot. One moment of weakness. I started thinking about Nico Robin. And I was like, oh, yeah. And my brain just decided to stop working altogether. Alright, how many fucking souls did I pick up? 4,000? Haven't played any Xenoblade games, but they remind me of the Yeast games. 
Oh, they are nothing alike. <laughs> well, I only played, to be fair, I only played, uh, what is it, East 8? The one that everyone recommends, and I didn't even fucking beat it or nothing. Like, I played a little bit of it, and I was like, this is kind of cool. And then I turned the corner, and I said, ooh, Room Factory 5. And I played that. <laughs> uh, only playing the first time now. Kind of cartoony, but modern. One thing I will say that I kind of find a little annoying about you say it's not really the game itself is that apparently there's a running gag in the series that like like every game your main character meets like a certain girl and they just instantly love them but your main character's like i love adventure and it's like oh it's kind of boring right you do that all the time <laughs> it's like just have the character not care about me if you're just gonna do that Chapter 5 of Beast 8 now. <laughs> I do get distracted during so many games, man. Listen. My brain, it just constantly goes, right? Like right now. Like right now as I was speaking, literally two seconds ago, I was thinking about like, um, before thinking about Nico Robin. I was like, I was like, you know what? I gotta, I gotta record some stuff for the Pokemon bullshit. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta get ready to do a quick little playthrough of uh Pokemon Crystal. Hello again. Okay, so what the hell am I carrying? Organize my bullshit. And catalyst, you can have that. Ooh, Assassin's Mask. Oh, black leather. Hold up. I didn't even realize I picked that up. I think I can run around the black leather set. Shut up. Shut up, Thomas. I'm talking to me. Not as durable, but you know. Right? Does it show you like magic resistance or anything? Let me see. Da -da -da. Versus magic 19. Versus magic on this shit. 19. Yeah, let's get the magic up, baby. How good is a uh, wizard's glove and black glove? 12 and. Well, these. Oh, Wizard's Glove has more defense than Black Glove. Hmm. Really? But Black Boots have higher poison resistance, right? Oh, yeah, definitely gonna be using that for when I head to the Valley of Shit. And this is just overall better. Okay, so magic resistance is pretty much the same, so just put on the mask, really. Hello again. I'm keeping a Hello again. Did I tell you that I abandoned my wife and child so they can get mauled by demons? Oh man, dude. I gotta fucking... I gotta get through demon souls so I can do dark souls so then I can... I don't know, I don't know what I'm gonna do for Castlevania, but you know... Since the spooky times are coming up, I want to do something for Castlevania. Definitely of the night. I'm not sure if I'm doing it on YouTube or if I stream it. Maybe on YouTube, just to make it easier. But Jesus. Oh, you really do notice that in the game. But that character is annoying anyway, so... <laughs> haven't tried to develop a bond anyways. Yeah, fucking... Uh, what's her name? It's the first girl you meet or whatever. She's like... <laughs> she's like, get away from me, you ruffians, or whatever the fuck. And I'm like, and I'm sitting there and I'm like, I'm like, is this going to be a thing throughout the whole entire game? Is there like anything that comes out of this? And it's like, no, they just like the main character for some fucking reason. They like, it's always a different girl every game. And I'm like, what's the point of doing that? Like there's, zero, there's like, like, Hey, you already have an anime game that has like, that has like fucking cooking and fucking and blacksmithing and crafting and all this other bullshit right and all these side quests so why wouldn't you capitalize on that other aspect of the game like if you're not gonna do that then why even make the character that way because instead of the character being a good character now the character is just like oh, is that bitch that just constantly trying to suck me right <laughs> like you know it's like it's so unnecessary 
it's like with the I haven't played I haven't played Horizon Forbidden West, but I have uh, played, you know, uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. And in that game, there's so many characters that are just like, "Hey, Aloy, I kind of like you. You want to hang out?" And like, at no point does Aloy ever like recognize that or anything. She just goes, she just goes like, like someone will just go like, "Hey, Aloy, I think you're kind of cool. You want to like get a drink sometime?" And then she'll be like, "So yeah, uh, we're going to the capital to kill the guy, right?" And then the person goes like, "Oh yeah, yeah, I guess, right?" And that's pretty much the extent of the of the fucking conversation. It's like, why even put that in there? Like, I get Aloy's character in those games. It's like, I got shit to do. I ain't got time for romance. That, and she's been a loner her whole life, so she's not really trusting when it comes to people. But it's like, why even put... Like, if you did that for one character, sure. But you did it for multiple characters, and there's no moment where she even... Like, it'll be, it'll be nice if she even, like, went fucking... If she went, like... If she went, like... Oh, yeah, no, sorry, I'm just not really looking for that right now. I got a lot of shit to do. Like, if she just addressed it, but completely sandbag, sandbags it the whole entire time. And it's like, why the fuck even do that? It's so annoying. It's so fucking annoying. And you don't gotta even make it, like, a big thing. Like, fucking Assassin's Creed, um... You know, if, to do it, like, as a casual thing. Assassin's Creed, uh, what you call it? Odyssey did it pretty well. Right? I played as Cassandra through that playthrough by the way that was a fun game characters in <laughs> zero yawn are super robotic except for like the one dude like the one dude with the you know, you know the dude with the fucking mustache got those mutton chops he's cool i like him i forgot his name though <laughs> right more than the robotic enemies exactly it's like why even but you know what? Haven't played Forbidden West. At some point I might, but there's other games I'd rather play before that. Like Xenoblade 3! Having a great time with it. My god, I'm loving that game. I'm loving that game especially because, you know, I love Xenoblade. <laughs> Xenoblade 1 and 2. One of the things that... Dude, there's something that a lot of people need to start understanding. Don't trust anything a fucking game dev ever tells you. Just don't. Just don't. Just don't. They either lie for marketing or they lie because they want to surprise you or some bullshit. So when people are like, do I gotta play Xenoblade 1 and 2 to understand 3? And it's like, no, you don't. Technically, you don't. Just like how technically you can play chess without knowing the rules to the game. But like... But like, it, there's no point. There's honestly no point to play Xenoblade 3 without playing 1 and 2 unless you just honestly don't care. Right? God, just playing that game, I'm sitting there, I'm like, like, the first two seconds of that game, it's just like, there's this event called Annihilation Events, and it happens when all these particles emerge or whatever, I'm like, oh, so you mean when the worlds come together, they can't handle it, so it just implodes on itself? Great. <laughs> the game starts with like, hey man, did you play Xenoblade 1 and 2? If you didn't, this shit's gonna be kind of confusing. A little bit. Just a little bit. Not too much, but like, you know. Motherfuckers get mentioned by name. Like, come on, man. Like, the gameplay style is just... It's like certain characters use the Xenoblade 1 style. Other characters use the Xenoblade 2 style. Fucking... Uh, the two factions are based off of races that you've only seen in Xenoblade 1 and 2. And they're fighting against each other. Right? And I'm just sitting there, I'm like, there's just... It's just too much, man. Too much. Who's the leader of your side? Oh, Melia Antiqua. You gotta play. Do you gotta play Resident? Uh, Resident Evil. Do you gotta play fucking Xenoblade One? Understand that? No, not really. But it would be better if you did. <laughs> right? huh. Fucking liars! It's called Final Fantasy VII Remake, guys. Fucking liars! You lying sack of shit! Don't trust any game dev. People should have learned this shit years ago. Don't trust any game dev at all. Fucking Christ! <laughs> Like, I had someone message me, like one of my friends, he's all like, see, the director said you don't have to play the two games. And then when the game came out, I started it up and I went, the director lied. <laughs> so fucking bad. Such a liar. Just like fucking Yoko Taro. Such a liar. What a dickhead. Never trust any, never trust game devs at all. But anyways.
I knew I wasn't going to have time to do Tower of Latria, but kind of ran around that to do, uh, you know, check it out, see how good the sword will be against it. So I'm probably going to use this to run around Latria when I come back to stream this bullshit. Because I am coming up on time. So, here's what's going to happen, right? <laughs> Call their laxative. Lexia. So, um, it was going to happen, right? Going to come back with more deaths tomorrow. Tomorrow night. You know, usual stream times and stuff like that. Got to run around, do Tower of Latria, and maybe have enough time to, uh, to tackle the first area of, of the heroes, whatever the fuck. What's this place called? Our Southern Shadowman. What is this place fucking called? Shrine of Storms. There you go. This is Tower of Latria, right? I'm not I'm not losing my mind. This is Latria. Yes, Tower of Latria. What the fuck is this called? I call it Shit Vale. But what, what is it? Valley of Defilement. There you go. Valley of Shitty. Right? So, definitely Valley of Defilement is the last place we're going to fucking do because I just... I never did it. And B, I just don't want to do no Poison Swamp bullshit. But, um... Yeah, so... We're going to come back with more deaths tomorrow at the usual stream time. Uh, as for the YouTube channel, I have completely finished uh, editing all the streams for, for uh, what you call it, Great Ace Attorney. So that's going to be coming out periodically throughout the week. And now that I completely edited all that stuff, the last episode of Hey You Pikachu is going to get edited shortly. And then after that, it's going to be like a quick spin-off, spin-off? A complete, a uh, quick, like, spotlight on, like, the other games in between to work our way to Pokemon Snap, and then after that, do, uh, Pokemon Crystal or whatever. And as for the other shit on YouTube, I don't know, maybe I'll find, like, another playthrough to do or something like that. Some, some things I, I have some time, you know? That's pretty much the plan for, uh, what's going on. Oh, also, once the Hey You Pikachu stuff... Once that last episode gets uploaded, I'm going to upload the rest of the Persona 4 streams. And then the Evil Within stuff, that's going to start getting uploaded after that. Those Evil Within streams. Because, oh god, that game that game's bad. <laughs> it's a bad game. But we beat it! And I still have to do the DLC before I, before I touch... Before I fucking touch Evil Within 2, God, Evil Within 2 better be a fucking good game. If it's not, I'm gonna be so mad. I might just cancel that playthrough altogether if that game's not good. But um, God, Evil Within 1 sucks so bad. But that's pretty much the plan, right? Um, what else is there? You know, I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think. Mm, no, I think that's pretty much it for like upcoming stuff so right for those who came and watched live on twitch thank you very much i greatly appreciate it right if you want to make it possible if you want to help to make it possible for me to uh have more stream you know more time to stream and have like a better time slot to do it in you can head over and sub or whatever you know get yourself a tier one sub or whatever and if you got a what you call it twitch prime gaming or whatever you know, you get a free sub to whoever fucking streamer you want to give it to it's, uh, at no additional cost for you. So that's pretty cool. If you're watching this on YouTube, first of all, thank you very much. I appreciate it. If you like what you see, leave a like and a comment. It helps out a lot. Way more than you think. Right? Because YouTube is full of shit. And besides that, my Twitter is right there. All my handles right there are on the screen. And if you want to follow me on Twitter, you can do that. And if you ever want to send like some, I don't know, some like art, some like fan art or some bullshit, just send it to the Twitter, right? And I'll throw it up at the beginning of the stream and stuff like that. And I think that is everything that I want to say for now. So, yeah. I've also been getting into VR chat. <laughs> so, you might, if you're someone who runs around in VR chat, you might find me one day. You might find me. Hanging out with a bunch of weirdos. <laughs> I'll be there. You know. You'll see me one of these days. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for me. So, 
as always, I want to say thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Stay happy, stay healthy, and take care.